Welcome to our channel. When Sin Avery's jabs at ex-GF Elisha Cuthbert landed him an indefinite suspension. In a shocking turn of events, Dallas Stars player Sin Avery has found himself suspended indefinitely by NHL Commissioner Gary Bettman for the inappropriate comments he made recently. The incident occurred during Avery's morning skate in Calgary, where he brazenly confronted reporters in the presence of a camera. With a complete lack of decorum, Avery remarked, I'm really happy to be back in Calgary. I love Canada, I just want to comment on how it has become like a common thing for hockey players to date my ex-girlfriends, my sloppy seconds. I don't know what that's about, but enjoy the game. This unprecedented suspension marks a career first for Avery. The co-general manager, Brett Hull, was disheartened, remarking, more than anything, he let his teammates down. Avery's target was none other than Alicia Cuthbert, known for her role in 24, who is currently in a relationship with Calgary defenseman Diane Phaneuf. Phaneuf defended Cuthbert's honor, stating, My thoughts were this was a very disrespectful comment, and the league took action, and I definitely agree with the way they took action. The NHL's swift suspension marks the first time Sean Avery has faced such disciplinary action. Despite his on-ice antics, this incident demonstrates an entirely new level of off-ice controversy. The league's response highlights a commitment to maintaining respect and professionalism among its players, even outside the rink. Hillary Rhoda's battle against ex-husband Sean Avery's alleged misconduct continues. Hillary Rhoda's restraining order against ex-husband Sean Avery has been extended by a judge, remaining in effect for over 10 months since its initial filing. The injunction bars Avery, 43, from contact with Rhoda, 36, and their three-year-old son, Nash, until September 12. The couple, who tied the knot in 2015 and welcomed Nash in 2020 after struggles and a miscarriage, filed for divorce in 2022. Rhoda's restraining order stems from an alleged September 2022 incident when Avery was arrested for domestic battery. Rhoda claimed Avery forcibly entered her house, shook her, and refused to leave. He was arrested and later released on bail. She also accused him of yelling, swearing, and name-calling, detailing instances of physical abuse against her, third parties, and her son. Avery allegedly body-slammed Nash and drove recklessly with him in the car. Thanks you for watching stay connected with us for more videos.